Hello! Welcome back. More Wind Waker. One second. If you don't know the understand the title, you had to be there. <laughs> anyway. Let's see, last time we completed this island, at least for now. Now we're gonna move on to the next island. Where do I need to go? Tell me, King of Red Lions. Objective marked on your sea chart. Got it. Map, straight south. Which is that direction. Okay. Hi, hey. hold it this, right there, small fry. Ah, this is what I need the bait for. I don't know where you got your mitts on that sea chart you got there. But it looks to me like it's pretty much got nothing but seas drawn on it. It's pathetic. In fact, it's a, almost an insult to call that thing a sea chart if you ask me. <laughs> What's the matter, small fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you that you got a problem, and you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island. So open up your seat shot, make it snappy. Jumps up, draws the island. Excuse me. There's a real peculiar cave toward the backside of this here Dragon Roost Island. A yeah, real peculiar. I doubt you'll ever get there to see it. Well, Fry, unless you manage to sprout wings and fly, that is. You won't be getting there otherwise. That's all I can teach you, Small Fry. But I will do this for you, since I'm feeling so generous. I'll send word to all my brethren living near the islands of the Great Sea. Good bunch of fish. See a fish leaping out of the water when you sail near an island? Sail up to it and spread bait out on the water surface. Trust me, it's good. this is good advice, Fry. Listen, the baiting process allows you to get a chart off the island along with any info that might be of use to you. I highly recommend that you make a habit of doing so. So you're definitely going to need a reliable sea chart to help you search for things out at sea. I can't emphasize that enough, Fry. You need a well-drawn chart. If you don't need a chart, get a chart for every island you come across. It'll just be a bigger hassle for you later on. I don't say I never did anything for you, Fry. Oh, you there, you kingly red lion guy. That's it, I repaid my debt, I'm gone. I'm done. You can take care of the rest. I don't know what kind of debt he was in. I just wonder what kind of mafia the King of Red Lions is running. Oh, there's the Volcano Island. Keep gathering the rupees. Oh, 
Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, still going. I, I do see a fish, I think. How are you? Yo. Yeah! Mighty fine boat you got there, bub. Must be searching for treasure on the sea floor, aren't you? Ha ha ha! You won't get any from us, bub. Not likely. Let me ask you something real quick. Who wanders around this on a fishless sea? I'll tell you who, bub. Only pirates, monsters, and treasure hunters like ourselves. Maybe some other things that I've never heard of. Uh-huh. Ugh. You know, with all the weak island dwellers who never leave their shores, I'm amazed to see such a tiny little guy out here. I like your style, bub. I feel like I've known you my whole life. But hey, bub, tell you what. As one treasure hunter to another, I'll give you, give you this. you have definitely been eating it if you want to haul up treasure. I won't take no for an answer. I won't take nay, no, per nar. Just grab it. See? Ah, treasure chart. Awesome. Okay. Nice. Anyway, I saw a fish. Hi, Colt Mother. Thank you for the raid. How are you? I can see that. Oh, it's 100 years early. How you doing? You can't win. Get ready for it. The flawless zone is the lawless zone is here. What do you mean you can't win? Awesome. Outlaws. The outlaws have raided me. On this, I'm playing the hero mode. How close am I? Okay, it's this island. I've already played this before, but it's just part of the series that I'm playing every single Zelda game. At least I'm trying to. Uh, we stopped kind of far out. Yes, you see what rises up from the horizon. That is where you must go, Hunter. The Forest Haven. We just got done watching 100 Death Shin Megami Tensei run. Woo! Nice. <clears throat> the Forest Haven. Great, this game 9 out of 10. Yeah, it's pretty high up there. It may appear as though this is but a great tree rising up far above the ocean's surface. It is a sacred place. It is inside this grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth, the great Deku tree. Too much water. It's Gen 3 all over again. You must speak with the Deku tree and receive from him a sacred gem known as Fiori's Pearl. <clears throat> I fear that Ganon's vile hand may have already reached the most sacred of sanctuaries. Go forth with caution, Hunter. Oh, apparently Beetle beat me to it. Yep. What you got? Making up for the other Zelda games' lack of oceans. Uh, bait. Lots of bait. 
Okay, my question is, where's the fish? Ah, that's the fish, I think. I think I saw it. Yeah, there it is. Right, give me a second here. Okay, can you stop? Okay. Items, bait bag. Here we go. Thank you, cult mother, for the follow. Hi, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I take it you want to chart information about this island. I start by opening your sea chart. I have the three average followers. I just need the fifty, the, the three, the three average watchers. I just need the fifty followers. That's all I need. Why is that partially transparent like that? Hang on. Oh, wait. That's why. Because it's so hard to see it. <laughs> that doesn't help. All right. Oh well. <coughs> a little bit north of here on Bomb Island, I've sometimes seen a merchant of incredible girth with a monstrous pack on his back. Now, what could he be doing on that lonely little isle? I tell you, there are some strange folk in the world, Fry. That's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear it again? You'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, but that's my policy, Fry. I can't go fighting evil on an empty stomach, you know? I just realized that these fish have ears. Like, it's not just the man face. They even have ears. Like they used to be Highlands or something. Well, that's... <laughs> Everybody ignore 100 years early. That is a blatant lie. <laughs> that is a blatant, bold-faced lie. <laughs> and with that, I'm off. The only drifting I'm going to be doing is... The only drifting that I'm going to be doing is drifting from one shore to the next. Ah! I forgot about you. Wrong button. There we go. Mm, that button. Okay. Ow! Feckin... There you go. There we go. Be the stream dreams team. Uh, what does this do? Oh. I just... Take the thing. All right. There we go. Now where's the? There you are. Hey, yeah. Uh... All right. Oh come on. Oh. <laughs> he just went and shoot on me. Okay. Fine. And you.
Thank you. Oh, care followed me. I didn't see it. I'm sorry. Thank you very much. I was uh, too focused on not getting eaten by a plant. Ah! Wrong button! Try that again. Hiya! Oh! Nope, that didn't work. Crap. Ah, that's annoying. This is the real challenge of this island. Every time you fail trying to get to the entrance, you go right back to the beginning. Check above a... Looks so dang good. Yeah. Ah, there's the thing I need. Let's not fall in the water. There we go. Up here. Yep. Almost drowned doing it. Can't climb that ledge though. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. Ah, right. I was dead. <laughs> I'm for the GameCube version, but man, this looks delicious. It does. Hey, Zach, how you doing? Let's try that again. Once more, with a little less suck. Ah, for fuck's sake. Uh, ow! God damn it. I jumped! <laughs> Wrong direction. I tried to go around and just ended up in the water. God, they don't need to charge it. Ah. I don't think I can avoid this one. Okay. No, nope, wrong button. Fuck. Let's, uh, take that off. How do I take it off? Just put it there. Okay. There we go. Oh, that's something. Okay, apparently I can't do it like that. I don't know what Laryl is. What is Laryl? Ah, feck, I forgot! Link's suddenly going beast mode. Okay, what is Laurel? Whee! Thank you. 
Okay, once more with a less stupid. You're done with law. Oh. Except that it doesn't make sense. Come on, work. Work! Roll into the tree. There you go. Oh. Ah! Ah! These things are more of a nuisance than I took them, gave them credit for. I got a green one. Yay! in real life. Good job. That garb you wear. Could you be the legendary hero? No, this is literally my pajamas. I woke up in this yesterday morning. As the king at long last found the hero of time. What's the matter? Do you not understand the ancient Hylian tongue? Ah! That's what he was saying! I forgot that this is New Game Plus. They translate Hylian. So you are not the hero of time. I must apologize. I was in error. I saw your clothing and suddenly I felt a longing for an age gone by. That longing caused the ancient tongue to pass my lips. I am the guardian spirit of this forest ha haven. The Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks for your aid in ridding me of those foul creatures. Tell me. Was it not the King of Red Lions, the boat who speaks, who led you to this place? So it is true. You have come here because you have need of the Pearl of the Goddess. I see. I know there was a reason the monsters had begun to congregate in the regions around my wood. I understand it. He has returned. Ganon has returned. Excuse me. In that case, we must make haste. Horrocks, little children of the woods, this traveler is not our, your enemy. Let your hearts be at ease, <clears throat> and show yourselves. What do you call yourself, Hunter? Well then, Hunter. These are the Koroks, the spirits of the forest. Once upon a time, long ago, the Koroks took on human forms, but when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Now they fear people, but to me they will never be my they will ever be my cherished little children. As it happens, you have come just in time for a ceremony that the Koroks hold but once a year it is about to begin. I shall grant the pearl to you once their ceremony is complete. I must apologize for the brief delay, but if the ceremony is not completed soon, an ill fate could befall us. Let it begin! Are you ready, my children? We are not, a oh great Deku Tree. Something terrible has happened. It is Makar! Makar! What is the matter, Linder? You and Makar are always late. Why does this keep turning on? No, it is not that, oh great Deku Tree. Makar fell into the Forbidden Woods. What?! The Forbidden Woods? I told him to be careful, but still, Makar flew above the Forbidden Woods, and as he drew close to it... Foolish little Makar. Oh, he's dead. Oh well. Can I have that pearl now? <laughs> Hunter, you have heard all this. The forbidden Woods are right beside the hollowed island of our forest haven. Those woods, the whole region is a vile place that is home to evil beasts. And now it seems they have taken a child of the forest named Makar. Your presence here is no mistake, I deem. The King of Red Lions likely expects great deeds of you. It is why he brought you here. I am sure to ask this I am sorry to ask this of you, but can you go rescue young Makar for me? The great Deku Tree, people cannot fly through the air. 
Ah, yes. Thank you, child. You are right. It is not possible to enter those woods from the sea, is it? I would guess from your size you are heavier than my Korok children, yet I think we may still be able to solve this dilemma. You must use the item I shall bestow upon you and fly through the sky. Considering how trees work, that's technically a strand of his pubic hair. <laughs> Forgive me, Hunter, but could you climb up to my crown and get the leaf from up there? <laughs> I have tainted you all. <laughs> Oh, wait. Shy! Ow, my cankles. Just made it. Ah! If I fall from here, it is my immediate doom. Okay. I got the Deku Leaf, set it to... yeah. Over here! Please, you must fly from over there to he here using your Deku Leaf. One second. Okay. That is the entrance that I need, isn't it? Is. Oh, wait. Luckily, magic pots still drop. <laughs> Very good, Mr. Swordsman. You've already mastered using the Deku Leaf. But since you're so much heavier than we are, you can't fly very far, can you? How unfortunate. Well, anyway, this is the exit that leads to the Forbidden Woods, where our brother Makar is being held. Please take care of Makar. You got it. No promises, though. Congratulations, Swordsman. It appears you have finally gotten the Deku Leaf. Yep. The wind can't carry you there. You'll fall into the sea. Yep. If only the wind were blowing in the right direction. Oh, how unfortunate. Oh, oh, look at that. Now it is. How about that? Okay. I think I can just make it to this thing. Okay. Now, next thing is going to be in the direction again. Okay. Now. Where is that... Do I need to use the tornado? 
I feel like there was a thing where I needed to use the tornado to send me flying up a bit more. Yeah, there we go. Almost there. Come on. Bugger off. There we go. Woo. There we go. Hey, that works. Or not. Okay. Woo, buddy. Uh... Nothing drops hearts. Why are there so many of you? Is there an end to you? Do you end? Nothing. Two left, I hope. That's one of them. I'm going to need the red drought specifically. Because eventually... Eventually, I'll be able to use them to make potions. I believe. Oh, buddy. Oh, yeah. Going in and out of these things just replenishes my magic. Uh, I'm trying to not hit the bomb. Okay, we're fine. Hi. I actually can't wait until I, until I get to Phantom Hourglass in the series, because that was the first Zelda game I played, and so that's going to be nothing but nostalgia for me. Never did understand how this thing works. I have some magic back. Nope, only rupees. Suffering from success. What did I just grab? I got a golden feather. Okay. I mean, I was young. I had a DS. Nope, that's the wrong button. Ah, there we go. I didn't know. My parents didn't know. I just... Yeah. General consensus. General consensus is wrong. <laughs> I loved it. Okay, that works. It's not what I was aiming for, but it works. I have half a heart. Oh, okay. Oh, that does work. Interesting. Yeah. 
going on the map stuff was really cool. Yeah. And in general, the... In general, the Toon Link series is... Is... Kinda good. I... Wasn't as much of a fan of Spirit Tracks, but it was still decent. That's fine, because now I'll have more hearts going in. Ship direction changing, cannon, like actual cannon combat, and the salvaging stuff. Yeah. Like the Wind Waker sequels could have been handled better. Hey, Chrono! They could have. Maybe. It's probably a general rule that everything gets some kind of remake. Pokemon Gen 1 has been remade twice already. We've got, uh, we've got this game, we've got Twilight Princess HD, we've got, uh, what was it? It was Link's Awakening Deluxe. We just got Skyward Sword HD. We work from scratch to revamp the system of it. Yeah, because I doubt that they literally just canceled, like, the DSiWare stuff like that. So if they're going to remake it, it's not going to be on, um... It's not going to be on a DS or anything like that anymore. Thank you. Alright, we have three hearts. Right. Link's Awakening situation would be ideal. Yeah, that would be interesting. Like, it's the same, but different. Lots of really cool ideas in these two games. There we go. Whee! This way. There you go. Alright, what? Ah. Uh. Can I just... I wonder if I can just push this. I can. There we go. Like the 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 main cons the main thing that I really didn't like about Spirit Tracks was that like in the previous two games, the worlds are basically open. But Spirit Tracks, you are literally confined to the directions that you are given. Okay, can't get that. So, how do? Hits it, but I don't do anything. It isn't creativity behind it was so pretty good. Yeah. Hmm. 
I don't think they could have uh, done it a little differently, I think. No, wait, this is what I'm supposed to do, isn't it? Or no, not quite that. Ah! I didn't mean to roll. There we go, that's what I wanted. Not that different for, with Linebeck's ship, you can go anywhere in the sea, but it doesn't amount to much more. But I mean, at least there was... ...things to do in the ocean. Like, other than fending off things or finding Beetle's uh, air balloon, you didn't have much else you could do. Like, at least there was some salvaging stuff and stuff like that. Ah, Shisa! I totally misjudged that. Concessions were made with Fumbo's hat, yeah. Let's try this again with a little less stupid. If I can do that. Woo! Salvaging was very good, way better than salvaging in this game. Yeah, it was like a mini game, which was interesting. So apparently I need this to get over there. Up. It feels like I'm approaching a mini-boss. Ah, yes. These things. Ah, uh, this button. Y'all done yet? Guess not. So I hate all other links except the Majora's Mask link, but I definitely like Wind Waker's link because this one actually gave him some form of story background and things like that. Well, if you want story background, you have Twilight Princess. You literally start off the whole thing. He's just a normal dude. For like an hour or a half hour at best. And then, uh, some fat dude with horns on his head rolls up and takes your girlfriend. Wasn't destined to be a hero. If we're talking about wasn't destined to be a hero, I don't think. A link has ever like forced their their self to be fuck, has forced the destiny of being a hero onto themselves. Ah! I don't think any link actually went looking for the Triforce to get the power of courage. I think every... every Link did. Mm. 
Okay, now what do I do about this? Okay, this doesn't help me. What am I doing in here? Do I have a key? I don't have any keys, I don't think. No, I don't have any keys. I have a bomb. Ah, uh, back up. Try I force choose you, you hero. That's the other thing, though, is that not every Link has a Triforce. Like, I don't think... I don't think uh, any Link had a Triforce until uh, Ocarina of Time. And even then, there are some after Ocarina of Time that don't have Triforce. That ha have the Triforce. They're just a uh, random badass that can just so happened to pull the sword from the stone. Trying to not get skewered by weird roots. Okay, I need this for something. And that's it. Ocarina and Link literally had to get the Sacred Stones to get the Master Sword. He didn't have to get the Sacred Stones. Well, okay, yeah, that's what you meant. I was talking about... I was thinking about the Sacred Power, not the Sacred Stones. My bad. I... Okay, I can toss it up there. But toss it from a distance. Well, that didn't go well. I toss it even though they're in the way? Yes, I can. Okay. That worked. Yes, it did. Okay. Just gotta get over there now. Ah! Oh. I gotta go all the way around. Yeah, there we go. Mm. Ah, feck! I got half a heart left. Shit. I need to get back to Windfall at some point and make some potions. I got a small key. Wait, what did I pull out of the other chest? I forget. Okay, this is just a way for me to get back. Oh, God. Back. Oh, well, I have the key now. Game over. Save and continue. I haven't seen Top of Accounting yet. You don't get the joke because you had to be there last time I played this game. Or at least seen the thing. No! Wrong button! That again. Ah, 
for fuck's sake. Really? Hold. There we go. Okay. There we go. This one. That didn't go well. Oh, you're still... I just got to go around this thing. And up here. This. I will take these. And then we go this way. Wait. This is incorrect. Something fell over behind me. I don't know what. Alright, that was the things that killed me before. I need to use this. Go in there. I completely walked past it. Whee! There we go. There you go. I love that they kept this idea for uh, Breath of the Wild. Using this to make things move. Oh god. There we go. Oh god. Oh, apparently I still have one on me. Let's see. I missed. Oh, come on! Let's try this instead. Oh, ah, I almost failed that. Got them all at once. With a heart and a half left. Oh. There you go. 
Okay, so for this, I probably need the boomerang, and this is probably the mid-boss, right? Yep. That's what tis. Oh, buddy. It looks like Majora's Mask, now that I look at it. That was close. Hey, there we go. And with half a heart. A lot of stuff, but not what I want. Alright. Oh, looks like the raid's over. Da -da -da -da! I got the boomerang! Right, of objects, yep. Awesome. Target the five objects. Oh, right. Oh, wait. go. Oh my. What if I have to cut these down or swing from them? it was the ladder. Oh, there's one left. I think I was supposed to swing from him. Where's Shaysa? from them? We're gonna find out. The answer is no. But what the hell do I do about this?
What do I do about this? Uh oh. That's not good. One second. Again, there you go. Not seeing anything that I can grip. I doubt floating over there is going to work. Will it? It will. Okay, never mind. I got the joy pendant. No hearts. Just like me. Oh, that's the wrong one. This one. There goes that. Da 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 da. -da. So what do I do about that? Just jump in the water, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Uh oh. I may have made a mistake. Well, damn it. <sighs> oh well, we're making progress. Slowly but surely. this. Let's request. Okay. Where, oh where, do I go from here? Up. This way. This way. And this way. Excuse me. Ooh. Oh, I can just take these guys out now. Crap, damn it. Ah, good. Two and a half.
Okay. I <sighs> walked right into that. This way. Up. Oh, wait. Don't have to go that way. Just this way. I can find a safe route. Go. Oh wait, I could just float down. What am I doing? What is this? Huh? Oh, that's just a way for me to get back up somehow. I don't not entirely sure how though. This is the right way. Okay. Now where do I go? Yep. Not this way. Oh, grand. I go this yep. way. Yep. There we go. Oh, God. No, no! Ah, get off me! Uh, heart and a half. Oh, that's gonna be good. Grab this first. Lovely. Yellow rupee. Nope. Oh, okay. How do I get out of the water? This is how. Apparently, gravity matters. There you go. Wrong button. Of course. Oh god, they just grow back. Let's just go. Oh, lovely. This again. That's just the sound of those things. Okay. Let's see. Get up here. Is there a certain order that I had to do this in? Doesn't seem like it. There you go.
This will be the boss key. Okay. Of course. God damn it. Too busy beating the one guy with the with the boomerang. I realized I wasn't pressing the B button and actually hurting him. Okay, try it again. Did I ever actually uncover this? I have no clue. Nope! The answer is no. I don't know where that is. Here. the plants. There you go. Up here. Nope, wait. I just remembered. This is not the way that I go. This is. Them. There we go. I just had a better speed build up like it did in Breath of the Wild, but no luck. fight these dudes again. There they are. Ah! Just 
just took out his own guy. That's one. There's two. Pirate's necklace, skull necklace. Oh, here we are. Oh, so I didn't have to do all that again. So what the hell do I... Ah. It's through there. Okay, so I was heading in the right direction. It gets to the end, apparently. there. I have, what, a heart and a half, maybe? Yep. Yeah. Of course. Toy pendant. Yay. All right, here's the boss room. And here's how I... Okay, there we go. Pick this up. Like this. And this. Okay. Here we go. That's going to go well. Hi. That is one working, one weird looking Deku Baba. Oh, God! Am I supposed to avoid that somehow? Doesn't seem to be any way for me to actually, like, avoid that. Which is weird. Unless I can hit it with the boomerang to make it freeze up for a second.
Death is inevitable. You cannot avoid it. I see you've gone through something. Hit something. What's in my mic? Come on. Oh, my, my, I'm not canceling the boomerang by jumping, am I? Apparently if I'm not fast enough, they hook back onto the roof. Which is especially annoying, when I also have to avoid the ones that go underneath me. Oh, that's what's happening. Oh, shit. Come on, damn it. Come on! Fall already! Are you serious? Ah! Oh my gosh, I can't hit him from there. Come on, damn it, fall! Fall already! God, this is annoying. Yes! Oh my god. Fuck! Ah! It takes out a whole heart. Spitting me out takes out a whole heart. How am I supposed to avoid this? Or how am I supposed to do this without taking any damage? Or as little damage as possible. The... Yeah. Even if I didn't get hit by the vines at all. Getting swallowed takes at least a heart by itself. Oh god, it glitched out. There we go. I don't think that worked. What? I wasn't even in the thing! What do you- It takes two hearts? Swallowing me takes two hearts? How do you expect me to fight this thing? I beg your pardon? How do I fight this thing without taking damage? Hold up, I actually have to look this up because I do not see an answer to this. Uh, Wind Waker. Flower Boss.
One boss with no damage. Okay. How do I fight this thing? Without taking any damage. Sorry. Okay. They're doing the thing. They don't. How do I go through this without taking damage? I only have four hearts, which means even if I had full... Even if I had full hearts... I'd still get bodied with two hits. Okay, so what they do is they just jump attack and then... They jump attack and then book. That makes sense. Okay. Oh, God. Nope, there's two left. Come on. Cut him! Or three. Whatever. Ah, it got me! I'm dead, aren't I? Not yet! I don't know how many of these I have left. Oh god. Oh shit! No! Fuck! I was actually making some progress there. <sighs> okay, so I need to start running up and hit B on my way up there. Then target, then hit A. Once more, I guess. I can do this!
Fuck, I got cut on the edge there. Maybe I do need to go back to Windfall first. Oh boy. Buddy, this works. No, fuck, I get caught at the edge there. Have just hit him and run. Okay, guess I need to go back to Windfall and grab a health potion because otherwise I'm dead on the de delivery. <sighs> now, how do I? Should have changed the direction of the wind first. Especially since I'm moving backwards. Go. Now let's try. Oh. Doing great. I'm doing great. Have zero magic. Just need to get myself to windfall one way or another. Is there an. No, there's no edge that I'm seeing. Okay. I think I'm gonna make it. Uh oh. Ah! Fuck. Okay then. Let's try this again. Get you if I can. Uh, oh, come on, come on! Uh oh. Just want to get back to Windfall so I can buy a health potion. Otherwise, I'm not going to last. Oh, no. I mean, let's do this. All right, come here, you. Hit the 
these while I'm here. All right. I can make it now. Hopefully. Aim to the side of the thing as it goes in a circle. There we go. Uh, back up! Back, back, back! Come on! Fuck! I had it. Come on, really? I can do the thing. Oh, I'll just jump without thinking first. All right. I have no clue how much damage those things did just then. Oh, I'm back. Perfect. You would happen to have a health potion, would you, Beetle? Nope. Bait. Okay. Now, where am I going? I think Windfall... ...is right there. Okay. I'm gonna change my change my direction here to northwest. For starters. Uh, wish there was a better place that I could buy potions. I can't wait until I get the the super sale. Wow, this is so slow, relatively speaking. <laughs> My God. What just happened? It's too soon for us to venture in this direction. We should sail directly for... King of Red Lions, you asshole! Does that mean I can't even, like, go back up north in order to get... You know, go the... The long way? Can I not backtrack? Storms on the horizon. You gonna let me keep going? You gonna let me keep going? Okay, so I have to backtrack the whole way in order to do this. God, I just, I just want a red potion. Because otherwise I'm not gonna survive.
I should have all the pieces for it, right? I have 16 red drops. I hope that's enough. Even for just one. I love that I can check that while I'm still sailing. Hey, it's the morning song from Ocarina of Time. Okay. There's that place, which I don't want to bother with right now. I don't have the necessary items to do anything with it. Okay, we'll start heading in this direction. Change the wind. West. A little bit in this direction. I can see it from here, I think. Maybe. I can't tell. I don't know what island is on this section. I know. Ev oh, that's the island for this section. So yeah, that is windfall in the far in the far uh, distance there, but that's not. Uh, this place isn't where I'm going quite yet. I really pay more attention when uh, the ocean is shining. I can probably get a lot of rupees from that, the auction house. There's a shiny place. Let me see this. Right here. There we go. Fifty rupees. Perfect. Yeah. More rupees. Oh, excuse me. Okay, let's see. I don't know if I can get the time song yet. Okay, dude's dancing. I probably can get the time song.
That's not it. Just not it. And the problem is, even though that's not it, this isn't it either. Oh dear, pardon me. Pardon me, guy. I was so fully and wholly absorbed in my dancing, I didn't even notice little old you standing there. Ow. I am tot. I have... I love dancing more than I love three meals a day. You will come to know me as the world's charismatic dancer extraordinaire. Ready, guy? One, two, one, two. You know what I was just reminded of? Long ago, I met uh, this delightful little guy who performed the most dazzling magic dance, a dance that turned night into day right before my very eyes. I can remember those fabulous dance moves, but I just can't seem to get that intricate rhythm down. Uh, what if I use this? Un, un, cha, un, un, cha. That's, that's it. That's the room I've been trying to recall. Oh, I can feel it. I can feel it, guy. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Right, left, down. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. There we go, Song of Passing. Okay. Hey, what's the matter? Nothing happened. Nothing at all. Why? Because you ain't got the power. But anyway, that was just part of why I came here. Get it around. The other part is this dude. Hi there. Hello, hello! You are standing in this one and only chew jelly juice shop. shop. You must have heard our potion. Okay, yeah. I get it. Alright. I should have an empty bottle. Yes. That's not put. Oh, that's not. Okay. Uh, you. There we go. I'll take five of them if you can spare them. One free serving. Every five gloves of chew jelly, I'll give you one free potion. Grand. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and I can buy this and I'll probably get the, uh... The bottles... Oh, I can't get... I can't get the bottle with it. Well, that sucks. Let's look into that later. But for now, I have my red potion that I came for. Question is... I don't know if the uh, the auction happens at night, or if I can even get into it right now. I think it happens at night. Hang on a second. All right, let's see. Now, I should be able to get in here. Hello there. Well now, good evening. Yep, auction is about to begin. Competition of the highest order. Do I detect a hint of curiosity? Sure. I'm fine with that. Yeah, I get it. Alright. 
If I get, if I do a high enough jump in the bid, then it'll stun them. A piece of heart. Okay. Starts at 80 rupees. I have 268. Okay, we're fine. Six. Nine. All right. All right. I'm gonna save this for a bit. Because eventually it'll run down. To, it'll start running down a timer. Hope I have enough. Oh, apparently I have to bid at some point. Forty-three seconds left. 109. Uh, I think I want to jump that by f 15, so... That should stun them for a bit. Hey, Amido! That's great to hear. I, all I did fix Dragon Quest VIII. I fixed it. I was running out, dear friends. Twenty-six seconds left. Ah, shit. Uh, shit. It's twenty-eight. So, time for the stream row. Awesome. My goodness. Seriously? I didn't stun them. That piece of heart. That much time left. I need to stun them for the last few seconds. 17. Okay. Let's just jump it up by... Let's... Uh, there we go. Yes! Okay. I don't know how long this will stun them for. Come on, please do long enough. Five seconds. Shit. Woo! Last second. I'll just top it off. Yes! 200 rupees for a piece of heart. All right. <laughs> Congratulations! Ah! I wonder which one is the... the super sailcloth. Let's see. Uh... Which... auction... Is the super sail cloth swift sail? Okay. okay. I get it at the auction house. Location auction house. It does not give me a list of items or win each pieces. So I don't know when I get the swift sail. Lovely. I'll have to come back and try again until I uh until I get it. Okay. I took most of my money, but I'm happy with my purchase. I'll come back for it later. Anyway. I now have full hearts, and I have to get to the tree.
Oh boy. So let's start with heading that direction? Yeah. Uh, this and then. Yeah, that way. All right, 30 minutes. Let's see if I can finally beat this boss without dying immediately. Because now I have preparation on my side. I did figure out one, uh, a couple things. One, I looked up, I looked up on uh, YouTube how to set up the graphics for D for DQ8 properly. So now it looks a hell of a lot better, runs a hell of a lot better. As far as I can tell, there don't seem to be any audio glitches for now. Also, I figured out that uh, for one, I can't, I just can't seem to get the joy the joystick to automatically make me run. But I did figure out that apparently there is a button combo that lets you run anyway, which is pressing the directional buttons instead of the joystick and holding a uh, triangle. So I, I switched the, the analog stick, I switched the, the joystick controls to the buttons. So now I just do that and hold triangle and I can run. It's a lot more convoluted than it needs to be, but it works. But at least I'm running now. Okay. Let's change this to south. Yeah. Okay. Fire Island. I may as well actually get these on my way. There's that fish. There you are. May as well grab this while I'm, while I'm here. I didn't hear what he said. Oh, okay. You see that there volcano that's spewing out lava? They say that there's a great treasure hidden inside that thing. Alright, so that, yeah, that's that. I can't get in there yet. If you decide you want to play DQ10 after 8 and 9, I wrote up a whole guide for myself on Google Drive that's literally a step-by-step -step guide to which tutorials you need to follow and in what order, a bunch of useful info and links. Using that, I was able to get the game set up in under two hours. This one half hours for installation update. The big wall of text. It's fine. It's very helpful. Uh, not sure if you can link me to that, but if you can link it uh, in whispers or... Uh, That'd be fantastic. I might, I might do it. I might play it. At least the, at least the 1.0 story. Because I understand it is a fucking huge game. It is literally an MMO, which is not a, ga a game style that I'm very accustomed to.
cool. But I'll try. I might try. All right. Leave me alone, please. Thank you. Each expansion packs its own storyline, but if you just want to play the original, I understand that it's just like a regular DQ game. Like, awesome. I mean, we might come back to it every once in a while. But first, we're going to play through the series by itself. Okay. Let's try to get up here without dying. It's probably going to be a consistent thing where I'm just completing a dungeon every stream. Oh yeah, also because of New Game Plus, there's like a an achievements thing that normally you have to go through something to open, but because New Game Plus is just always open. You can see the hatch open over there. This button. Let's put this thing back on here. Oh, that worked. Awesome, thank you very much. And I missed. Of course I did. That was incorrect. God damn it. I'm so bad. Ah, I forgot I need to use the rope again. I'm a good gamer. And I'm fantastic at 3D Zelda games. It's just that bullshit is a thing. It's the only problem. Okay. okay I can't climb that wall, apparently. Oh yeah, you weren't here when I made this joke earlier. But, technically speaking, 
Uh, when it comes to how trees work, when that's that's the Deku tree, by the way. But considering the way that trees work, technically speaking, uh, this thing, this, this, <laughs> this thing is basically the Deku tree's pubic hair. <laughs> I'm so sorry. And that happened. Okay. I deserve that. Alright, let's see. There it is. Hup. Oh, God. Oh, thank you. I missed entirely! Congratulations, you're a dumbass. Oh. Pay for it. There we go. Okay, come on. Work with me here. Really? What is happening? Why can't I get in there? There we go. Come on. I'm gonna have to turn it like this. There we go. There we go. Now we're talking. Okay. I'm down one heart again for no reason. There's a direction here to I think this direction. Yeah. And up. Here, some magic there. Magic there. I made a mistake! Yeah. Well, I'm going in there with a bit less confidence than I had anticipated, but... I gotta wait for that tornado to spin around the entire place. <clears throat> there we go. Don't you dare. Don't you fucking dare. There we go. Okay. Two and a half hearts every time this guy hit uh, swallows me. I take two hearts worth of damage. This is going to be fun.
Oh boy. No! Oh great, this guy swallows me now that I'm going to die. It! Did I get him? Oh, missed one. Come on, hit him! Yes, okay. Ah, come on! Oh boy. Ah, come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. I missed? Really? No, I didn't miss. A few of them grew back. The lighters. <laughs> Fucking pieces of shit. I spent 15 minutes just trying to get back there. Just get, get out! Fuck! I'm dead. Because of the double damage, I take two hearts of damage every time he does that. <sighs> it's an almost unavoidable attack, and it sucks. And now I don't have my potion anymore. So I literally have to go in and do like, eh, eh, eh. A little bit at a time. And hope that I'm fast enough just to take his... At least... You two have that in common. Yep. I am always pissed when I die. Yeah. When I, when I actually die one day, I'll probably look real fucking angry. Oh, wait. Let's not be in the way of whatever tries to hit me there. God, fuck you. Really? No, you... Okay, I made it before... Okay, I made it. Ah. Oh, that's not good. How are you not down yet? There you go. Get out. Oh, that was close. It's way too fucking close. Oh, buddy.
Come on. There you go. No! Uh. No! God! <gasps> I am pissed. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is such a difficulty spike. Why would you use a boss with an almost unavoidable attack like that? And I can't even heal from drops in this mode. Ah! I came in here with such confidence. Let me put this away. God damn it! Indirectly piss for you too. Yep. Why would you make a boss with an almost unavoidable attack like this? Are you serious? Okay. God damn it. Stop doing bullshit. Like blocking me with your fucking body. Come on, just drop. Drop, damn it. Thank you. Run. That's not a good thing. Break my chair. This thing is almost new, except for the cat scratches on the seat. I don't know how much damage this thing takes. Round two. Oh, it's it's nowhere close to that. This is probably round seven. And that's thinking positively. Yeah, I hit a few apparently. No, oh, God.
Uh, apparently I didn't register that hit. Get it. Back! I tried to do a jump attack because it does more damage. Round 94, you <laughs> onion-shaped piece of shit. And I'm dead. Round 95. <sighs> One of my emojis is going to be Link with a gun. I just really want to see that. <laughs> God! Leave me alone a little bit, will ya? Ah, come on! I was off the fucking pedals! What the hell do you mean? Are you serious? It adjusted the camera? Stop adjusting the camera when I'm trying to throw hands and boomerangs. I'm just. There you go. Ah! Okay. Okay, just walk up, hit it twice, run. If you can even do that. Uh, apparently, I hit a bump. Nope. Come on. Ball. There you go. Run! No! Why did you do that? Why would you design it like this? I am severely pissed off. The rage cannot be contained. Like three more. Ah, no! It took too long to get there. And I don't know, fuck you, boss. Just fuck this boss in particular. I think I had problems with it even when it was normal. Normal gameplay. Hit something at least. Come on. That was a good one. I got you playing on hard mode. Yep.
Oh. I don't know what happened there, but I got, like, almost all of them. I'll take it. Slow and steady wins the race. Slow and steady beats the boss. I hit the wall. Don't! Oh no, that's not good. There's no direction. A few left. Fuck! Great. Oh, I made it. Okay, where is a crevice that I can hide in? Come on. Yes! Fuck you in particular! Ah! Uh, literally every other boss is going to be downhill from here. Oh my god. Swordsman, are you the one who rescued me? Yes, be thankful. You have my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on Earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The great Deku Tree sent you? That's right, today's the day of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble, I shouldn't be here. I must get out there immediately. This was the game that introduced the Koroks? This version of the Koroks, yes. Macaw, you have returned safely. I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry, Great Deku Tree. I know you warned us many times, but still I did not listen. Do not worry, Macaw. You are safe now. Just be more careful from now on. You have done well, Hunter. I must thank you for your brave deeds. Here is that which I have promised you. Please accept it. Not sure if I want that if it's been sitting up in your pubes. It is my hope that this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your songs for me as you always do. That's right! We must begin our ceremony soon before the day ends! Let the ceremony begin! The songs in this game are fantastic. Minus the Korok singing, but still. I like the di I like the little ditty. Love how expressive Link is in this. Yeah. Great Deku Tree, this year you have once again produced some splendid seeds. With these seeds, we will continue to spread new forests across the Great Sea. Let us go, Koroks, to the sea! See you all next year! Take care! 
Very well, great swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. So now, over the various islands, I'll just end up... Hey, Tovenu. Who... Uh, so now, uh, over the various, various islands, I'll sometimes run into Koroks, and they'll request that I bring some water from here. To them. But now... Now what? Uh... Okay. So now I just leave, I guess. Okay. I don't want to bother with you. Ale? What have we here? Good morning. Letter for Hunter. We have one letter. Here is your letter. <laughs> Dear Hunter, if you're reading this letter, it can only mean you have peeked into one of our many post boxes. I am indebted to you. I'm very sorry I let you leave without thanking you. Please accept my heartfelt apology along with my thanks. We cannot do... Much to help you, but we can at least do this. If we get any letters or parcels for you, we will deliver them to a post box near you. If you see any wiggling post boxes, please look inside them. Okay. May fortune fill your wings. I got a piece of heart. I need two more. Here is your letter. <coughs> and also various diseases. This place, too, has been attacked by Ganon. Could he already be regaining his power? Hunter, you must get the remaining pearl. It lies in a place northwest of here. You must set sail immediately. All right. Oh, lovely. That's really far. You can't quite see, but we're down here. We gotta go all the way over here. And the sailcloth we have is extremely slow. I don't even have uh, uh, tornado jumping yet. Anyway. So, for now, we're going to leave that there. So, thank you all so much for showing up. I got two new followers. I got Cult Mother and Care Zero. I am so grateful to y'all. Thank you all so much. I only have 11 left until I have 50, and then I can finally apply for affiliates. Yay! That's going to be great. Uh, but yeah, again, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Again, we'll leave this here. Tomorrow we'll be on Dragon Quest VIII again. I fixed it. Relatively speaking. Yes, I am. Relatively speaking, I have fixed it. So we'll actually get some shit done instead of nonchalantly walking back and forth bet between the town and the dun the first dungeon. But we'll see how that goes. But again, thank y'all so much for coming by. I hope to see y'all again tomorrow. And until then, I hope y'all have a good rest of your day. I'll see y'all later. Bye, Mido.